Mr. Sorkar. This is Sorkar. Asking for Seven six two seven six two seven six. Okay. Disappearance. Physically, when it is physics, some, one thing, when it is emotional, that is another thing. Physics means the light rays are not going into your eyes, are registering in the brain, the stimulus is not being created. That is the physics of disappearing. But disappearing, you know, absence in presence, is a worst sort of disappearance. If somebody's presence is not being noted, mm -hmm. if you go to a marketplace, there's thousands of people walking, but everybody missing because you don't know anybody. It's like the, a grain of sand. A grain of sand. Mm -hmm. So they have disappeared. Yes. That is, this is not physical disappearance. Uh, we magicians, when you make something disappear, basically it is physics disappear. The physical disappearance, mm -hmm. the light, the dimensions, the existence by which we describe the matter, those are not measurable or fathomable. Then we call it to be disappeared. But uh, the other physical, I mean, properties like uh, uh, if I get a small material, that, that, that rubber square thing, square thing, do. yeah. If this particular thing, it is not mine, it is his, if I keep it here and we, if we consider it to be disappeared, it is not disappeared, it is kept here. It is an illusion I am creating, I am pretending as if I have kept it there, but it is actually hidden here then it becomes an art of entertainment, for the cause of entertainment. But the person who doesn't know the secret behind, he will call it to be disappeared. And if I drop it here and then pick it up and then do like this, and both the hands are empty, it becomes magic. Let me come to the, to the, to the center of this topic, mm -hmm. superstition. If it is romantically correct for the cause of happiness, I love superstition. If it is for a selfish reason, for religious benefit or, or supporting a selfish motive, Political motive oh no, and it is a bad thing. A fairy tale should be supported. I love Cinderella, isn't it? Who doesn't? And by Isn't loving it? Cinderella, if somebody says that uh, we are promoting superstition, no, that's not true. No, it is romantically on the exactly on the other side. But if I say ghosts and all, they are on the fifty-fifty side, yes. on the on the yes. threshold. The, the belief in ghosts has got a romantic side also, because it is creative thought. I have got doubts. 
those doubts can make me balance and walk. But if I push them towards a religion or anti-religion, that is another religion or, or something for political reasons, benefits, then we are away from it. Philosophy will never push you towards that. Yes. Yeah, yes. but uh, there are people who misuse philosophy. They are bad Misinterprets people. Misinterprets it and put, packages yeah. it in such a way that yeah. you are pushed towards the dark side. Um, to an untrained mind who has not probably thought about a certain subject uh, to the very depths of it, uh, it is easy to, um, what should I say, brainwash them into believing certain things. But then um, magic, fairy tales, um, uh, mysticism and surrealistic uh, paintings. paintings. Uh, yeah. This is a work of art, it's an imagination, it's, it's your mind playing beautiful games. So uh, why should it be bad? It, it cannot be. Mm. Three things to be, uh, I mean, to be noted. Possibility. Mm -hmm. Number two, politicality. Implications, yes. Yeah. Number three, poetic. So we, we have to see the poetic mm. balance of this. Possibility number one. And the political implications, yes. if, if it is hurting anybody's sentiment or not. So, it, then you can do it, mm. yeah. Possibility wise, it is physical possibility. Like when I tried it on Taj Mahal, I had Yona and a big slum where I could remove those people, vacant land, mm. because there is a cultivation land and people stayed there. So that, I, that privacy is there? Yes. yes. Let, us, let us call it to be privacy, mm -hmm. name it to be privacy, but their absence was required. Yes. When we wanted it to disappear and uh, that actually caused a crisis in the minds of the people, then what happens to our very beloved Taj Mahal? Mm -hmm. The audience, who, the spectators who were there, who saw the disappearance of the Taj Mahal, I mean that was something to be noted. But when actually we see the Taj Mahal standing there in all its glory, we do not feel um, the need for the preservation of the emotion and uh, you know the the uh, not the physical entity, but uh, the emotional side of it. We need to preserve that as well. A ship comes here, so somewhere here, and it is shown to the people from the ship. Possible, mm -hmm. yeah. Mm. If you want to make these people mm. want to see it, you have to cover this much of area. Yeah. Mm. If the people are sitting here, you have to cover this much of area. Mm -hmm. You cannot go to that side. No, no. This side, that side. This is the only side. Apparently, mm -hmm. the much of which I have seen or have felt. It is not impossible. It is possible. The answer is positive. Now comes physical inspection. We have to uh, see the adverse things, which uh, which kind uh, can, I mean, create, can create mm -hmm. uh, the scientific problems. Political side maybe you can handle. Uh, poetic th things maybe sh you can handle. But first of all, let us think of. The, f the scientific practical. practical side of it. Unless this ecology is yes. studied, not by this. Mm. Physical uh, the, physical this much is enough. This, this is saying yes. But now we have to go and study the unseen impossibilities mm. which might crop up. Because after doing so many things, all of a sudden say, you know, nothing happening. Because that thing has happened. It is rained in Spain. <laughs> <laughs> yes. You understand? Suppose we have, we have gone there to perform. Yes. Staying there for an extra 10, 15 days in search of the right season, but nobody would know it. Mm. And he was showing me the place around as a tourist. I'm seeing it, taking the data and smelling the weather every day. So then, then we can get an idea. And, and, an and idea. These are the possibilities. Yeah. And then the X factor, the God's factor is there. 
if that day tsunami comes, what can you do? <laughs> so, we have to wait for the right moment. Mm -hmm. And if, if I get the signal, no, the weather is changing. Stop doing it. So even if it is for 10 seconds, I'm happy. You have to be prepared mm -hmm. for all possible all outcomes yes. of that event. Yes. Uh, because so if, if if it just might happen that it won't happen at all. At all. Yeah. Maybe uh, if the rain starts, yeah. gone. Uh, if it is told to them that we are going to make that disappear, then they start imagining seeing it. Their mind's eye opens up. Okay. I said, no, it didn't go. In photograph, it is gone. Psychologically. Psychologically, yes. yeah. So we should not say anything. It is as if a lecture demonstration, a song program, or a things happening. They should not know what they is going what, to come. What is the final they thing coming? Not know. Must not. Civilization has come to a place right now where people have forgotten what to become proud of and what is pride. Pride is not to attack and win, no. Pride is to become something to have and to be proud of. Something which will add to humanity. Yes. Uh, not and take to, away from it. Yeah, and to, uh, I, 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 I feel proud of this. Mm -hmm. Yes. They came to India because the binocular or the telescope they had, they had one imaginary India here, mm -hmm. which I love. They're leading to India and, I, and I'm standing there saying, welcome. So that should be the motto. And if this poetically corrected attitude towards people is given, I think the world becomes a better place. It is not fighting. It is not sucking it is not it is discovering my portugal is land of poetry that to heroism yes land of heroes heroes yes. that is what a one if i call myself to be educated or enlightened one enlightened indian would tell you they, they fight they discover they have they are the strings of making the garland, the whole uh, universe, this universe mm. is tied up. They, they were the pioneers who did this. Mapping the world yes. is not an easy task. <laughs> history so. is too serious a subject to be left on the historians only. Yes. <laughs> the historians, mm. they are going to dry people. It is so serious a subject. The romance in it, the life in it, the love in it, that is, that is more important than the printed book of history. Which Be is invariably short-sighted and one-sided. Because who appointed him? Yeah. Who appointed him? Why would he write? No, the, even the word history, his story. story. <laughs> Obviously, it's all about him. <laughs> the king's story. Yeah. King paid money, write good. What have you written? You have written that? Hey, kill him. <laughs> Bring another historian. Yeah, another historian. <laughs> it has to be good. You understand what's the meaning of good? <clears throat> right. Make me look like a hero. Yes, sir. You are son of God directly. Mm -hmm. Right. And whatever you have done is very good for people. People, are, people love you so much. You have contributed so much. You have educated people. Right. Don't say that, don't say that I suck blood. You know Mount Everest? Yes. Yeah. There is another mountain called Sagar Mata. Do you know that? Most unfortunate part of it. Before the British came, mm -hmm. the Nepalese called it the same mountain to be Sagar Mata. So when they discovered it, they rejected the old name. Mm -hmm. and Mr. Important. Everest who climbed up. No, he never climbed up. Uh, exactly. Mm -hmm. That's the tragedy. I mean... Um, One Radhanath Sikdar. One local person was appointed to go and with theodometer to measure. He reported the whole thing. Sir, this is the tallest one. Oh, great thing you have done. So he sent it back to England. It is Mount Everest because Mr. Everest submitted the paper. This is history. Mm, yes. yes. So where goes Hagarmata? Where goes Radhana Sikdar? Tragic.
but who cares? But they can never buy a poet. No money can buy a poet. I'm a poet. I. <laughs> <laughs>